to Jazz on My Mind. I'm Richard Blackwell, and today we're in the beautiful city of Hokanson, Delaware, and we're at the home of Bobby and Jean Fleming as they present their annual jazz picnic. Now, this picnic is also in association with the Council of Jazz Advocates, the Delaware chapter. Now, get yourself ready as today we're going to bring you some wonderful jazz performances and some great interviews because the whole theme of today is keeping jazz alive. And what a better place to do it than here on Jazz On My Mind. So, Mr. Blackwell, I turn it over to you. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, let's put our hands together for a fabulous job that Jean and Bobby Fleming are doing today. Now, like Mr. Fleming said, my name is Richard Blackwell and I have a website I'm the host of that website, and if you wish, you can write it down because you will see performances and interviews from this wonderful picnic today. The website, once again, is called jazzonmymind.com, and the whole premise of the website is the same thing that the Flemings are doing, is keeping jazz alive. Let me hear a round of applause for everyone out there who likes to keep, who wants to keep jazz alive. And that's why we are here. Now, I'm from California. I've been here about two months. That's why I have on a long shirt. I have yet to get acclimated to, this, <laughs> to the weather here. But um, it's a beautiful thing, jazz, the art of jazz. And we want to do everything we can on the website to make sure that we keep jazz alive. I want to thank all the musicians for coming out today. Mr. Tony Williams and everyone else. Let's give the musicians a big round of applause. Also, I noticed today that Alfie Moss and Dexter Koontz are here. Let's give them a big round of applause. They are my friends in jazz, and you can also see them on my website. And once again, it's called jazzonmymind.com. And I hope a little bit later, if we come to ask some of you guys for your response to what's going on, that we'll put it on video and put it on the website. So hopefully when we come to you and say, hey, what do you think about what's going on this afternoon? You can give us a couple of words, and we'll put it up on the website as well. All right? Thank you very much, and enjoy the rest of the afternoon. Thank you. And ladies and gentlemen, we are in the home of Bobby and Jean Fleming, the wonderful host for this afternoon's jazz picnic. Jean, Bobby, welcome to Jazz on My Mind. Thank you. Thank you. Now, this is a wonderful situation you got going on. What is your affiliation with jazz. Tell us about your love for jazz. Well, my love for jazz goes back a long way. <laughs> uh, well, uh, I'm a native of Delaware, and okay. of course Clifford Brown was one of yes. his own, plus my cousin Gerald Price, they called him Judy. Okay. Uh, Gerald Judy Price, which was a native of Wilmington, okay. started this jazz picnic in, in 1989. Wow. And uh, he had some of his players with Jack. Uh, Did it come Bobby to... Blackwell. Right. Uh, yeah. What's his name? Bobby Blackwell. Oh, no. Who's on the Al Saxbury. Okay. Al Saxbury. Okay. And uh, he had some other folks I had. And then Miss Justine. I knew everybody knows Miss Justine from Philadelphia. Okay. So anyway, we started our little backyard picnic, <laughs> and now it has involved a great, uh, everybody wants to come, they'll see you on the street. Are you the lady that has the jazz picnic in their backyard? I said, yes. Wow. And I said, you're welcome to come. Just bring something for the table and a chair to sit on, <laughs> and come and have a good day. Wow. So anyway, we've been doing this, like I said, since 1989, but it has really mushroomed now. And we get a lot of folks from far and near. One time a gentleman came from New, uh, from New York, mm. uh, came down to play. About an hour and a half away. Yeah, he yeah, yeah. yeah, he drove down. Mm -hmm. And uh, it is just getting bigger each year, you know. And, it, and we enjoy it. We enjoy doing That's it. Great. We are getting older, as you can <laughs> see. But as long as we can do it, we're going to do it. It's all about keeping yeah, jazz alive. That's it. That's it. Because the legacy of jazz is really, our young people do not know yes. the legacy of jazz. And it, it is, uh, we don't know, a lot of them don't know who Clifford Brown is. That's great. That's great. Yeah, but we, I have a grandson and he's very up on these kinds of things because he's been around us. 
and we keep him, you know, he's informed of what's, so, what's going on. Now, when you mentioned Clifford Brown, Mrs. Fleming, I noticed on Mr. Fleming's hat head, I noticed that you've got a 2008 DuPont Clifford Brown Jazz Festival hat on your head. Yes, I do. Uh, every year, the city of Wilmington gives a uh, jazz festival known as the Clifford Brown Jazz Festival. This is about their, also about their 19th year doing this. Wow, okay. And uh, this hat is a result of one of the promos that they have every year. Okay. And we feature a lot of different musicians from all over the country. It's, I guess it's about the world's biggest free concert <laughs> in the world. Uh -huh. And uh, it is sponsored and uh, maintained by the uh, mayor's, mayor's office. And we have DuPont Company sponsored it and also the Bank of America. But the main money, the main thrust comes from the people themselves. Mm -hmm. the people who love jazz. This is one reason why my wife and I give our jazz picnic because we want to keep jazz alive. We want to know everybody to know where jazz originated, mm -hmm. where 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 it came from, mm -hmm. and the history of jazz. And we don't want that to get lost. Sometimes history gets lost and then becomes rewritten. Yes. So this is what we don't want to happen. That is correct. And uh, so we, my wife would just say we in 20 years given our jazz uh, picnic out here. Mm -hmm. Musicians come, they play because they love to play and they love the people who come because they appreciate what they're doing. Mm -hmm. And it's just a wonderful, wonderful thing. We, we're going to give as long as we possibly can. And getting back to the Clifford Brown Jazz Festival, it's held every year in July, in June, mm -hmm. around the second week of June. So if anybody's in the vicinity at that time, mm -hmm. they're welcome to come in. It's a whole week of it, free. Yes. And, and we don't find that too much anymore. And it was a wonderful concert. We were uh, at the event this year. Mm -hmm. And, and it was a wonderful event. Yes, it was. And I, I, my hat goes off to both of you two for your job and what you're doing in keeping jazz alive. Now, before we go, collectively, can you two tell us some of the people that are here at the picnic today? Uh, who are some of the people that you have? I know Tony Williams is here, uh, Alfie, Alfie Moss, Moss, and Dexter Coons. Who are some of the other people that you notice are here today? Well, we, we have we have uh, the county the local musician. We have Tony Smith, a very great trumpet player. Uh -huh. Ronnie Smith, wonderful guy on tenor. He's been playing for many many years. His father is a great outdoor uh, wow. player. And okay. Ronnie's following in his footsteps. Okay. We have Harry Spencer, wonderful alto player. Mm -hmm. Tompkins, a pianist, uh, some other, I'm trying to think of some other, uh, uh, Kamal Ugun, mm -hmm. who plays the Congress, he's also a member of our jazz group, our jazz group. Uh, okay, in Philadelphia we have Tony Williams, alto player, Lucy Barnes comes down every year, he's not here this year, but he comes every, every year. Dennis Fortune. Dennis Fortune is here, he's a former Philadelphia, he now resides in, uh, in Wilmington, in Delaware, in Bay of Delaware. Uh, you mentioned Dexter Coons and yes. Alan Moss. Miss Justine, the singer. Mm -hmm. Miss Pearl Williams, the singer. Mm -hmm. And uh, we don't see her at this time, but it's a very fine singer. Well, Mr. and Mrs. Fleming, I want to thank you for inviting Jazz on My Mind out to be a part of this annual Jazz Picnic 2009. We really appreciate it. And I want you to know that Jazz on My Mind will be there to support you in any way we can to help you keep Jazz alive. All right, well, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mr. Fleming. We want to thank you for, for, for coming and interviewing us well, it's, it's and, right. and getting it out to the people around it, here in it's, Delaware. It's our extreme it. pleasure. We need it. And like I said, anything that we can do, don't hesitate to give us a call. Thank you All so right? much. Thank you thank as well. You. Thank you so much. My pleasure. My name is Richard Blackwell, and thank you for watching Jazz, Jazz on, on My Mind. mind.